I, I booked a f yeah. room, and I can't take a on the toilet I paid for. And Rick's Titan's like halfway off of the trailer. We booked a place <clears throat> days ago, and we cannot get into the thing. Ryan, it's locked. It's uh, called. There's nobody here. And then only to find out that we get here and we have no place to stay. <laughs> what was the reasoning that they could not open it? I think or that it was, they did not open it? And I quote, I forgot. I said, hey, my name's Caleb. I slept outside last night. I just want my key, and I want to talk to your manager. Alright, what's up guys? It is 6.45, 6.30. We finally got a good night's rest. Uh, we're gonna try a different spot, see if we can get some trout, see if we can get some um, redfish off a bank. We're gonna pick up some live shrimp right now and uh, try to make it a productive day too. Forty-four shrimp, sir. Forty-four. Thank you, sir. It's so crazy that it floats in the back. <laughs> we go right here, right? We go right here? Red, <laughs> micro red, bro. I was reeling my lineup. Micro red, they're fired up though, dude. He hit it. At least something's pulling my line this morning. No, he's in. Get him out of there. You know what? Free spool. No. I mean, it's like taking me, bro. All right, without sticking my fucking pen in the water. Where are you at? He's got me, bro. This dude's got me by the balls.
He got off. He didn't break me. He just got off. That was a good one. Uh. Oh, I got bit. Yeah, yeah this doesn't feel big. Close it right. Nice little red. I know you have to like close it a certain way. Like hit, like it has to line. Yeah. I mean, I think this spot is pretty cool. Like, there's there's fish here. This spot is a good spot when it's windy. We should have come here and like you can't really go anywhere else. You know. Yeah. Like like you're right. Evening, now knowing how close and like how calm it is, this would have been perfect for evening. That's not his fault. Did you get the battery? Yeah, like it only said like 20% this morning. No, let me tie it back here. No. We did this yesterday, it worked out pretty good. I thought about doing it right now, but I still think this is easier. Yeah. All right, y'all just don't let my boat. Huh? Sweating balls. Yeah. It's the humidity. I don't feel bad. Fish on! First cast! Cork. Cork! Live shrimp! Probably a gaff top! Yeah. No! Feels like a gaff top! Gaff top! Yeah. Trout well, on live. Ow. Little trout, guys. Send him back.
Here, let me get you out of the weeds. What is it, a voodoo? Oh, what? We get fish the berms and do all that bullshit. I'm tired. How did it go today? Um, Give me a synopsis. It, it should be that way. Yeah, it should be that way. So, honey hole. There's not a honey hole. Across the bank, there are some pylons. And for a good hour, hour and a half, it was like every 15 minutes, we get, we get something. Biggest one we caught was 16 inch red. Eric caught a couple sheep's head. We'll show you what we did with those. And we uh, threw those back because uh, oh, we're getting no meat off of them. Look at the text. Look at the text. I didn't get anything. Look at the group text, then go look at it. Oh, sure. I would look at what? I didn't get anything. Okay, go check your group text. You should have a message. If you're on FaceTime right now, you should have a message. All right. Eric, you think we're going to fillet this little tiny sheep's head? You're an idiot for keeping this. <laughs> Anyway, uh, we had no other option. Our plan B was go out to the bay, go see if there's working birds. Obviously, there weren't. So we worked some rocks. Zachary caught a what's the keeping limit? 18 inch. So I caught one 18 inch red, oh, a 17 and three fourths. And that was it. That was the day. It's 100 degrees outside. We're like 50 50 on if we go this evening. What's the plan? Uh. Final day? Final day, final run. We got there for like an hour and a half. Try to get some uh, something. Take a catfish, dude. Whatever. Don't take anything. Catch you. <laughs> it was probably like a speed walk. Like kind of like, it's not effortless, but like you could do a speed walk for a good while. I'm gonna chum right here since we had the most success. I think it's super shallow there though. I don't know about I don't know about this Don't come here in the summer. Yeah, that's that's, that's all this. I mean, it gets rid of a lot of problems. We've talked talked about boats. We talked about guides. Let's just come here when it's yeah, freaking fire. I think I think when I'm 35 years old, we'll reevaluate on the boat. I can't do this forever, bro. The loading unloading is not it's not gonna be possible. Like I know we lift, we work out, we do all this stuff. Like I don't care how good a shape you are, you can't lift that shit later in life. And by yourself, forget it. You know what I'm saying? Like I got that's an issue, right? Tunnel, bro. Like we're gonna need to get a boat if you want to keep fishing, or you just fucking quit. Like pitch me, you and Caleb. Each of you pitch me your idea how the boat's gonna work. Oh, I don't, I don't want a boat now. Now, so you're just gonna buy a boat and we're all gonna get to use it? Pretty much. Well, I mean, that's one way to work. I yeah. think, like, to supplement how I hard can't come here in the summer. We just, I won't. We do just it. get. Very hard. He's good, people. His family's good. Live. All right, what's up, guys? Well, if you made it through this entire video. <laughs> We apologize <laughs> for what we're bringing you. Uh, that being said, we concluded the trip with uh, zero keepers. And uh, you don't like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> Tell your friends about us. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Let's talk about that. Talk about that with me. It burns from like here down. It, it Can you take a couple steps back so we can get like some good lighting on it? I have to be over here. You're gonna have to be over there or something. See if you can tell the difference. <laughs> it's a pretty consistent line across. <laughs> Thank you.